Hurricane Katrina, the tragedy of New Orleans. On Tuesday, the 23rd of August, 2005, a tropical storm formed over the Bahamas. By the 25th of August, the storm had strengthened and become Hurricane Katrina. Residents of the city of New Orleans had no idea that within days their city would be hit by one of the worst disasters in U.S. history. Hurricane Katrina was one of the most powerful storms that has ever hit the Atlantic coast, with winds of over 270 kilometers per hour. When the eye of the storm missed the city by about 72 kilometers, everyone thought the worst was over, but they were very wrong. New Orleans has always been under threat from flooding, being surrounded by the Mississippi River and Lake Pontchartrain. With most of the city meters below sea level, a series of high walls called levees protected it. As the hurricane came ashore, it brought an eight meter high storm surge that smashed through the levees. Over a million residents had already left the city, but tens of thousands, mainly the elderly and the poor, were in temporary shelters. As the waters rose, people were begging for help on roofs. Emergency services struggled to cope. Eventually, the military and the National Guard moved into the city and began to get food and water to the desperate few that remained. After 43 days, army engineers pumped the last of the flood water out of the city. These days, New Orleans is making a slow recovery. The city has improved the levees, the community is rebuilding itself, and everyone is working hard to make sure that nothing like this will ever happen again.